2011, the Cortez Travel Agency presumably booked trips for people. But Caustic investigates found for $120, they produced and sold documents that could only come from the U.S. government, like a permanent resident card, also known as a green card, which is necessary to become an American citizen. Do you need to have two last names on the green card? $120, like I told you. Will it be available tomorrow? In two hours. These cards came from this store. So why are you lying to me? Okay, we've got these from this store. $120, Mr. Cortez. Mm -hmm. You just told me that you don't do this. But these came from your store. So did someone make it up? Well, no, you, you can speak in English, sir. You did well the last time. After several investigations beginning in 2006, we stopped one dog breeder from selling sick puppies across the country. Ma'am, if you go to Virginia, will you do the same thing again? Is that, is that, ma'am, are you using profanity because you got caught? No, because you're a murderer. Ma'am, who did I exactly, who did I murder, ma'am? The dogs. Or did I just put a bad person out of business? Idiot. In 2002, our numerous consumer investigations led to the arrests and charges against D. Hughes, whose company was ripping off multiple people on many plumbing jobs. Can you explain this check, ma'am, why it has a dead woman's name on it? Excuse me, you're you stalking me. Cut your camera. How about these bounce checks from Sunrest? And in 2001, this was my first Call 6 hidden camera investigation. Our focus, a store selling fake social security cards in Indianapolis. My picture was taken as part of their process and my cover was immediately blown. I was no longer undercover and this voicemail was the proof. Listen you, why don't you talk to me? We can shoot it out when you want to. End of message. And in message indeed. None of those stories would be possible, though, without your tips, your emails, and your concern for others. So let's keep it going in 2018.